Jesus Christ. That was loud. Alright, what's up, people? It's me, Rosa React. <laughs> Tell there's a fear episode. I don't know why I didn't load into the game before I started the episode. But fuck it, dude. Oh, shit. So, we left off on our new room. It's about fucking time, right, ladies and gents? We're in a new room. With new with new stuff. And new shit to explore. And new things that are going to happen. It's going to be phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. We got the skin in there. And we have the new room. That we are going to walk into. And we're just going to hop right into it. Let's jump right into it. Okay. Good meme. Good meme, Gavin. Ha 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 ha. Thanks, man. Ha ha. New room. It's about goddamn time. We're here. We're on. We're both experiencing this at the same time with no halters. So let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Okay, demonic whispering. What be you trying to lead me to? Ooh, Honey, violent. what in the world are you doing? What did the doctor say about straining yourself? Leave that thing alone. It's not going anywhere. Alright, so is he talking to his wife? Or... Or what? That creeped me the fuck out. It's gotta be his wife, right? This is the room we were in at the beginning of the game. That's the same bed. It's the same layout. We're in the same room. Ladies and gentlemen, it's official. We've gone back in time. That's pretty epic. This is literally the same room. It's got music. His, whole, his wife is literally a, a musician, so... It's gotta be his wife. Is this what I think it is? If this starts singing, I, I swear to God. Uh, it's doing it in reverse. It's that song, but it's in reverse. It's the same song, but it's in reverse. Uh, 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 uh. Demon battle! I needed a jar and a plastic tubing. I siphoned gas before. I knew how it was done. I stuck the tube in a vein and sucked on it until blood filled my mouth. What is wrong with this dude? Then put the tube in the jar and it just kept coming. A taste of copper haunted oh. me the entire night. Why didn't I think of a syringe? You maniac. You maniac. What the hell? You want me to play this shit again? Wait, what if I do it? I can't, I can't go the other way. Yeah, you can. I told you guys it was the same song! What did I say? Well, everything's fixing itself, so this is good, right? 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 Okay. Okay. I mean... Huh. Prosthesis. Snatchers. Insatiable bastards. Can't afford a new one. Why the damn leg? I don't know, man. Why the damn schizophrenia, huh? Exactly. Exactly. Back I go. Let's add this to our wonderful painting. Full of oh, stop looking at me. Okay, like so that. this randomly just appears just a, here. That makes sense. something to help me focus on my work. That's all. That's all. Yeah, no, it's uh, that's not it's not helping you focus there, but it's it's making you 
not not very good. Let's put the blood on our on our painting. Yeah, more blood, more blood. First we put skin, now we put blood. It's beautiful. What do you mean? Okay. <laughs> Yeah, this guy's fucking insane. He's literally insane. He's an alcoholic, schizophrenic. He's insane. I can't stand stand seeing you like this. You're not well. You were sweating and shaking all night, and now there you are, locked in your workshop as usual. The whole tortured artist nonsense has to stop. I like the piano. Wait, <gasps> we're back here. We're back here. Whoa, what the fuck was that? You guys heard that shit? We're back here. It's the same hallway. Um, this looks interesting. Why is it? Oh, oh. I'll take that. Rodent seeds. I see the dirt move. Rotten soil. Nothing else grows. Interesting. Phenomenal. Okay, dude. <laughs> it's just like the ghost is just like yeah let me open the window and then this fucking the wind outside will blow the vase down to the ground it's fucking awesome that is the weirdest scare i've seen in this game yet that's fucking funny what was that Wait. Fuck, it's locked! What opened? It couldn't have been this, could it? What opened? Motherfucker, what opened? I don't know, dog. Or did something. I. Okay, buddy. I don't know what the fuck is going on. That was seriously the weirdest scare I've ever seen. That shit was something else. <laughs> okay, buddy. Oh, it's her piano. Wow, conveniently plays the last chord as soon as we walk into the, the room. That's pretty epic. Um, the piano scared me a little bit. I'm not gonna lie, but that creaking made me think the monsters over there. I don't think I. I know I'm the monster, Mike, but. But Kevin, you are the monster. No, the monster's over there. You fuck. Yes, I think it is. I hope it is. I'll see you guys later. I'm I, I, I'm out. I'm out of here. Why do you make me do this? Why do you people? Oh, it's not as dark as I thought it was. Wow, it it just seemed it just had really weird contrast for some reason. Told you the monster was over here. What did I say? What did I say? Oh, this is a really weird fucking ha hallway, dude. What the fuck is this? Who? Oh! Who? Ah. Uh. Uh. What? Wait. Cr uh, crater's block. I guess I'm in a crater's block. Thanks, hanging baby. 
for the for the key. Um, thanks. Guess this is the creator's block, huh? You you know, I, I guess it's just a block that you get trapped in, and then boom, decrepit hallway. You know, that's that's what a creator's block is, huh? Yeah, that's yeah. We good back here? Oh, so that door auto opens if you don't find it. We good in here? I heard a glass break over here. We good? Oh! Okay, I have to admit, that was pretty epic. <laughs> that was fucking cool. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, okay. <laughs> Guess we're in the room now. I mean, this shit is getting crazier and crazier as we go on. This shit is fucking weird. This shit is fucking weird. Okay, buddy. Uh, June, don't forget. Okay. Right. I did not do that. I did not do that. Did you do that painting? Did you do that? I did not do that. What about you? I did not do that. Hey, listen up. It was not me. I do it with this one too. Okay, dude. I. I see how it is. You just want to blow down a door sometimes, once in a while, you know? Just, just blow it down, just like the, you know? Just blow it down. Fine. It's cool. You, you know, your schizophrenia makes you a little, a little angry sometimes. Okay, just pull out your inner hole and blow down the door. It's fine. Oh, that's pretty epic. I, you know, I just want to check this out a little bit. Turn around and whoosh, there's something there. I don't know. That game does that. Uh, this game does that a lot, you know? And it's just. Always something behind you. <laughs> you really can't pick that up? What the fuck? I'm literally in the drawer. I'm so determined to get this. I'm literally in the drawer and I still can't get it. What the fuck was that? I heard something. Okay, buddy. Never mind. Dominoes, nice to see you again. Alcohol. This is a dark door. Why not go to this one? Okay. Well, um, not that I'm scared of that. I just want to see what this door leads to. That is going to le lead to the same exact thing. I still don't know if the whispers are a good thing or a bad thing in this game. From what we've gotten, it's a bad thing. But I'm just going to follow the whispers. Oh, it's this dude! What's up, man? You ugly fuck, it's nice to see you again. Not really, because you're ugly as hell. But, sure. I have to turn my face here. What is going on? Turn the light on? What am I doing? What is this? Oh, right there. Ugly. 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 Yeah, you're fucking ugly. You ordered a true portrait, so that's where I painted you, fucking pleb. Oh, Me we got him a pleb. Me artistic sense in your stupid face. Okay, buddy, you need to work on your anger issues, all right? It is an ugly painting, though, dog. I'm just saying. Onward, I suppose. Oh, we could go down there. Oh, we can go forward. No, we can't go forward. <laughs> God damn it. Let's go. Let's go down the stairs into this phenomenal looking room. It looks nice and cozy. It looks awesomely fun. It looks phenomenal. can't read it. I'm not. I hate that. I really don't like that. Huh. Well then, I suppose we go onward through another door. Oh, this hallway is fun. Oh, I just got the goosebumps. Unnecessary painting! 
completely unnecessary of you. Um. Demon? I see! Ah, I don't like this at all. I'm getting multiple goosebumps. Am I going in circles? No, I'm not. Demon! Uh. Oh shit! Hello? Ring, 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 ring. Ring, 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 See, I'm too fucking smart, dude. I'm too good. Oh, yes, because. Okay, we gotta keep going this way because it's going. If we run that way, it, it, it time goes in reverse. Like everything will go in reverse if we go that way. We go this way, everything's fine and dandy. Through the phone. Yes. Speak. Hello? Hello? Yes. Speak. Yes. What? What? What fire? fire. Oh, God. oh God. God. Is she? Is she? Which hospital? Which hospital? I I'm on my way. So, we picked up a letter of hospital burning down. I'm pretty sure it was St. Anne, wasn't it? I'm pretty sure it was. So his wife was actually at St. Anne because of the experiments he was pulling on her, right? Like, he was at the, he was using her skin. He drawed her blood out. So his wife was staying there, and it burned down. So. Dear sir, if I'm to be honest, I can't say your letter was unexpected. Numerous colleagues have infer informed me that you had previously sought their advice in this matter, and while it is perfectly understandable for a patient to demand a second opinion, excuse me, uh, second opinion, where was I? I would think 16 concurrent opinions would be enough. Still, out of respect for you and your wife, I have examined the case thoroughly, and I have to concur with my colleagues. And involuntary muscle spasms are not uncommon with patients who have suffered burns as severe as your wife did. That proves that that's what happened. So she didn't die, at least. But she, not only was he experimenting on her and using her skin for his paintings, which is fucking just sadistic is the best way I could put it. It's sadistic. But he was using her blood. And then on top of that, she got fucking severe burns because in the hospital she was staying in like this girl just cannot catch a break and this it's all this dude's fault like it's all his fault he's he's a fucked up person but what you refer as as a freakish or was that where it was yeah what you refer to as a freakish grin or an unnerving yelp though many would find such expressions hurtful could be indeed be manifested in this manifestations of nerve damage the other symptoms you mentioned did not seem to be psychological but rather purely wait physiological but rather purely psychological in nature traumatic events can lead to severe stress and that is nothing to be ashamed of as to your demand that we fix so his schizophrenia was pulled out like because of the the traumatic event uh, he had schizophrenia right so he he encountered this traumatic event and that's when his schizophrenia started to activate is the best <laughs> best way I could put it really so like as soon as his wife got burned that's when he started to become schizophrenic I do believe as you demand that we fix your wife you have to understand that she went through what she went through cannot be undone with one simple procedure. It is a long, adroit, uh, adroit process that will require all your strength and support.
please feel free to contact me or my colleagues should you wish to discuss the long-term rehabilitation program. Sincerely, Robert Richards, another fucking quack. It won't open. It actually... That was weird. What the hell is going on? That's awesome. You love you love this, don't you? Blood on the ground, restless memories on the wall. You know, you love to see this flickering light. All the ambiance in the world. Phenomenal. Huh. Okay, dude. Yeah. Right. <laughs> you done? <laughs> you just wanted to, to just freak me out a little bit, didn't they? Wait. So, okay, if we're walking around, and this is his wife, it's not, he has schizophrenia, right? So, if you think about it, right, obviously, everything we're seeing, it's all a part of his schizophrenia. It has to be, doesn't it? It has to be. So, his wife, which I'm assuming is that monster in his eyes, is his wife. The monster in his eyes is his wife. So we're walking around and it's scaring us, but notice it's not like coming after us or anything because it's its wife. Five head thinking, five head thinking, five head thinking. This is certainly interesting. Flapping horror, be quiet, constantly flapping, eating other rats. Why didn't this door shut? That's interesting. Certainly interesting. There, bud. I don't think there's anything in here. I might as well check these. Uh, nope. Alrighty then, let's go to the next door. Okay. Oddly long hallway. I'm coming for that booty! I'm stuck, I can't move. Why did you push me? Why did you push me? <gasps> Shit, it's her, it's her, it's her, it's her. I'll help you. Or not? Okay, dude. Weirdly long hallway, by the way. Just saying, this is a fucking long hallway. Really fucking long hallway. What the fuck is the point of this? Hello? Oh, we're here again. Oh, let's get it, boys. Going down this time. Over here, abandon, abandon hope while you can. Well, you know, I actually have a lot of hope, so I don't think I can abandon it, you know. In any case, as your lawyer, I advise you to refrain from any imprudent actions. In other words, don't do anything stupid. We still have a chance of winning this. Believe it or not, I've gotten clients out of deeper shit than this. Just don't make it any worse. Lay low for a while and, and let me 
appeal the court order. The social worker definitely has it in for you. We can use that to our advantage. Portray you as a victim of the system. A husband in mourning. So she did die. Or did she? Is he mourning about her accident or her death? I think it makes more sense for her to be dead. A momentary lapse of reason, an overzealous bureaucrat. Trust me, this is our best option. Considering what you've been through lately, I'd say we have a good 50-50 chance of a good outcome. But not if you keep trying to convince everyone that you've gone completely insane. No more outbursts, no more rambling, better yet, no public appearances whatsoever. But he is insane. He has gone insane. So I do think his wife died. His wife definitely died. And, uh, and that pushed him over the edge, and now he's insane. Like, he was demented before, but he's insane now. Like, he, he's lost it completely since his wife died. And his wife had to have died. There's no way. Well, this is a fun hallway. Is anyone through this hole? Hello? Nope, just a candle. That's phenomenal. I love candles. Why not? Let's go in the weird pantry. The oddly long pantry. The weird figure at the end of it. Well. That was certainly something. Uh... I don't like bathrooms. <laughs> no, <laughs> I think I'm good. I think I'll continue this way. Demented hallway or demented bathroom? What do we want? Hmm. I think we go with the hallway. Locked. Oh, this is certainly fucked up, isn't it? There are pipes everywhere, dog. Light on. Locked. Locked. Hola? Body barrels, feeding on me, driving me insane, too fast to cut out. Interesting, interesting indeed. But we can't go in there. What if we went back? Can we go back and go into the bathroom? I don't think we can. No, we can't. Unfortunately. You gotta make your choice. We made this one. Let's continue. Oh, this room again. Except that's three doors now. Hmm. Okay, brick wall. Brick wall number two. Long hallway with creepy candles. Brick wall number three. Well, no choice there. Oh, that's... I, I'm drunk. I'm drunk. I am an alcoholic after all. I am somehow drunk. I have received drunkenness. Basement! It's nice to see you again! No, it's not! Fuck off. I'm going back. I'm gonna jump out the window. Oh, let's go down into the depths of hell. Phenomenal. I love the basement. You know, it was fine at the beginning of the game, but now since the scares are in full force, it's not fine. It's absolutely not fine. Oh, it actually has more lighting than before, so I kind of like it down here. Okay, apparently there's a bunch of trucks driving over top of us right now. It's awesome. It's not the That's a mask. Awesome. Cool. Oh, it's her piano. That's phenomenal. 
the trucks are getting louder. I guess they're right above us right now. Should I really be doing this? I like a magic show. I like me a good magic show, guys. I guess playing the piano was a good call. Like me a good magic show. It's leading me somewhere. I thought it was, but apparently not. Oh, it's this again. I needed to remove the flesh from the bone. At uh, first, I was lost as to how, but then I sawed it off with a handsaw. This dude just gets worse and it, worse, dog. Then put the bone in a mortar. What the fuck? I had to get one. Obviously, this was not something I'd done before. Finally, I mixed the dust with some white paint. It made for a lovely undercoat. Oh my god. We're back in the normal basement. Dread, patient, thirsty fury, leeches, afraid to look up. Um. Getting the fuck out of there, getting the fuck out of there, getting the fuck out of there, getting the. This is a really long climb, motherfucker. Oh my god, Do, have you guys ever heard of running up the stairs? Alright, we gooch, we gooch. Hey, his room doesn't look that bad anymore. For some reason. And so the painting changes form into a... Demon with an eyeball. Demon with an eyeball. It's his wife. It's his wife. So it is. What if you fail? I won't fail. God, how long have we been going? 34 minutes, ladies and gentlemen. You just closed on me, dog? What the? F ladies and gentlemen, as much as I hate the end of the episode here, I gotta end the episode here. I wanna keep playing, dog, but. Ah, uh, I gotta get off, man. Alright, but I do hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Finally, an episode goes off without a hitch. Jesus. So I do hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, this was an interesting one. It certainly was. This game, it's great. I, I really enjoy this game. This game has a really interesting story. I really enjoy this game. And... I can't wait to finish it up with you guys because it does seem like it is coming to an end even though we still got three more cabins. We opened two in this episode. 30 minutes. So I reckon we probably got another 40. We probably got another episode left on this game. 
So I do hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I know I enjoyed playing. I appreciate all the support you guys have had on the series so far. This is an awesome game, and I appreciate the fact that I could play it for you guys and have you guys enjoyed it as well. It's just fucking awesome. So... I hate even now. Lost, alone, hopeless. You always will be a grotesque misunderstanding. So this is a letter from his wife to him. Has to be. But yeah. Really enjoying this game. I, and um, I appreciate all the support. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. But first, I have to say. Please like, subscribe, hit the button. You see all my videos in there. All amazing. Now I will see you in the next episode. Motherfucker. How do you how do you fuck up your own outro, bud? All right. Later guys.